What's up you guys, welcome back. So today's video, I wanna share with you some of my favorite Amazon purchases. Now, I have Amazon Prime, so I purchase a lot of things through Amazon with beauty related, fashion, it could be literally anything. But I wanted to share with you guys some of my favorite like beauty style products that I've gotten on Amazon. Amazon is just one of those places that are taking over the world, I swear, but I get such a better deal sometimes when I shop on Amazon versus anywhere else. These products I'm about to show you, I use on a day-to-day -day basis, if not weekly basis, so I thought it'd be, you know, a fun little video to show you guys my personal favorites. If you like seeing videos like this, then just give them a thumbs up because like I said, I buy a lot more on Amazon that I would love to share with you guys because I feel like these are must haves. But for now, I'm just gonna be sharing you these products. So let's get into it. So for the first item that I'm gonna show you guys, I'm gonna be reading off my phone to like read the details and then show you guys the product. This is the Fancy Waterproof Facial Cleansing Spin Brush with three exfoliating brush heads, complete face spa system, and it's an advanced microdermabrasion for gentle exfoliation and deep scrubbing. So this is what the guy looks like, how it came in. You have the tool and then you have three different brush head attachments. Now, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Clarisonic. When the Clarisonic hit the market, it was just so innovative. Like I worked at Sephora at the time when it came out and all of us were just like, this is the best thing ever. But if you know Clarisonic, it is pretty pricey. So I personally have one. I've had one since about 2012. So I've had it for about eight years and it's still kicking. Depending on what Clarisonic you get, the minimum one is like a hundred dollars and then it goes up in price. So I thought this for $26, would be worth to try it. So looking at it, um, it's battery powered. The other one that you have to charge, which sometimes is kind of annoying to me. Um, so that's different about this. And then this one has two different settings, which I do it on this setting. I want a nice little scrub. The difference for me is this one completely spins where the Clarisonic oscillates. So there's definitely a difference in the feeling when you're washing your face. I did feel like when I was using this, it felt maybe a little bit not as gentle as my Clarisonic, um, but after a few days, my skin kind of got adjusted to it. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but so far I really like it. I think it does a really good job of cleansing my skin. Of course, I go and cleanse my skin first. I actually do a double cleanse, and then I go ahead and I just use this for the remainder to get whatever is left on my skin, and it does a really, really good job. I have not used the other attachments though. Um, this one's the softer one. I do have more sensitive skin, so um, I will try the other one, see if I like it, but I've had this for a little bit over a month, and I really don't have any complaints. I think it does a really, really good job. Since we're on the subject of skin and skincare cleaning, um, the next item that I'm gonna show you, this is called the, I think it's Waleen, how you pronounce it, but they're just spa facial headbands. I wanted to get these because I'm constantly washing my face, constantly doing masks, and I have very long hair that just gets <laughs> everywhere. So I wanted something that was gonna protect my hair when I was washing or masking. So for under $8, you got this really nice pack of three, and these are nice. Like the quality and the material is really great along with the Velcro on here. And basically what you do, normally I have my hair up in a clip, but you can do it however you'd like. You just kind of take it like this, wrap it around, and I look crazy, but you know, if you did it nicer, it would look nicer. But it's just gonna help to keep your hair out of your face when you're washing and you're masking. And I just think it's really, really nice because then I'm able to get a little bit closer to my hairline and still keeping my hair tucked and pulled away. I'm also a licensed esthetician, so things like this just like really get me. I feel like I'm extra fancy when I'm doing my skincare. Like I feel like I'm at a spa. So really, really good quality, and I love the colors that come with it too. Continuing to protect the hair, this is my next item. So this guy is the Mickey Mini, I think that's how you say it. This is just a shower cap, and this is in the long hair. I believe that there was other um, sizes that you can get, so this is the XL. I do have longer hair, so I wanted to make sure that the cap you know, covered all that. But for $9.99, this is what it looks like. So for $10, some of you might be like, I can get a cap that's way cheaper than that. I actually owned a cap that was way cheaper than that. I thought that the cap got really dingy and I feel like it wasn't really protecting my hair. So I was like, you know what? I really wanna invest in like a nice one and see if it's any different than the cheap one that I had. And this one really is, like the material is way nicer. I feel like when my hair is up, 
in this when I'm showering that it doesn't leave my hair feeling staticky or it keeps it dry, things like that. And I love that it is big enough for all of my hair to go into because this is how I do it. I like to take a clip and I just pull my hair back out of my face. I twist my hair like so. I go ahead and I clip it like that. And then I just go and I apply the cap right over and <laughs> I look funny, but it allows everything to stay up and keeps everything well covered, which is what I really like. Again, with the type of material that it is, it just leaves, it's just so much more comfortable to wear it when you're in the shower. I wash my hair every other day, so this is really important for me to have within my weekly routine just to keep my hair nice and covered because it will get wet and become a nasty frizzy mess. Again, you might be able to find some cheaper, but I really do find that this one, with it being a little bit more pricier than some of your cheaper ones, was totally worth it. So I'm also a makeup artist, so I'm constantly doing my makeup as well. Sometimes I'll do my hair before my makeup, sometimes I'll do my makeup before my hair, but when my hair is done and dried and I'm going to do my makeup, I needed something to keep out of my face without crimping and kinking my hair. So I found this brand called Mad Holly and it is an eight piece, no bend hair clip, curl pin clips, no crease hair clips, for makeup and they come in eight pieces again I got four blacks two pinks and two whites it came in this right here when I was doing my makeup routine I had a headband that was just a really thin kind of it was like a cloth type um, that would just pull my hair back ever so slightly but it still ended up like kinking and creasing my hair along here like it would give this like weird you know so I was like, you know what, I'm sick of it. I want to see if there's anything that really doesn't kink the hair. And that's where I found these guys. So I ordered it and I was like, you know what, let's see if it works. And it does. So I literally just pull my hair back just like this. Push my hair all the way out of my face. And now my hair is secure. There's nothing in the way of getting in the way of me doing my makeup, anything like that. And... I swear you pull it out and there is not a crease or a kink. So I highly, highly recommend these. They are amazing just to keep the hair out of the face. You know, I've actually seen like girls make this kind of like a little trend, just like a little cute hair clip accessory look and I'm here for it. it. Like I said, keeps the hair out of the face and if you have long hair or just any type of hair that does this, this is so nice to have. So now I wanna move on to lashes. So these lashes, um, say it's from Kiss, they're the V Lux Extensive Cluster Medium Eyelashes and it's in a two pack. I believe you can still purchase them on their own but I think it might be cheaper if you get them for two. I, I have to double check. Some of my favorite eyelashes to work with are Ardell. You can get them anywhere, Sally's Beauty, Target, Walmart, and obviously online to their site. Um, I don't really wear lashes all the time. I'm wearing some right now, but I am a makeup artist and I freelance. And so a lot of my clients do love that option of having false lashes. I started doing individual ones about a year and a half ago and my clients prefer them so much more as do I. They are so much more comfortable than wearing a strip lash in my opinion. I can wear strip lashes sometimes if I cut them up, but majority of the time, if it's just a full strip lash, like my eyes are just completely irritated the entire night. Now I came across these at one of my local beauty supply stores over here. It's called Cali Beauty. I had never tried this brand before. They looked really luxe, but they were expensive. They were about $10. I did have a coupon, so I was like, you know what? Let's try them. See if you like these a little bit more than the Ardell. And I actually ended up this specific type of cluster. I like these so much more than Ardell. So I basically like ended up buying out the entire Cali Beauty and then they weren't supplying them fast enough for my weddings and just like my freelance jobs. So I was like, you know what, let me check on Amazon to see if they have them there. And they did, and they had them for almost $3 cheaper. So now I just purchased these off of Amazon because why not? Again, I have Prime, so usually it comes within a day or two. I mean, that's super convenient, but I absolutely love these. These are a staple when I'm wearing false lashes, and especially with my clients, they're obsessed with these. Now I have these makeup bags that I wanna talk about. So these are from Ugg Bunny. They're a multi-purpose waterproof clear vinyl zipper, and it comes in a pack of four for $9.99. Now I travel, so I really like to have 
bags on hand, especially clear ones because you can see what's in them. But these ones in particular, I actually use in my freelance brag. So this is one lip bag that I keep in there with some of my lip liners, liquid lipsticks, and regular lipsticks to hold for my clients. But this material is actually really, really nice. Like they don't, it doesn't feel cheap, cheap to have four of these. I feel like I've had other bags in the past where one of them were $10 and it felt like this. So I feel like you get a really good quality and for how many that you get for the price. And it's not like a cheapy, cheapy zipper either. Like it's really well made. I like them a lot, um, but super easy to travel with and just, you know, in general to carry your makeup. These definitely are a must. Now, speaking of products that hold your makeup, these two that I'm about to show you, I have talked about so many times on my Instagram and you guys love them and want to hear more about them. So I thought I would just share them again on here for you guys. So the first one that I'm going to talk about it is the Adept Marble Extra Large Empty Magnetic Palette. It holds up to 70 standard magnetic eyeshadows um, and it comes with free magnetic stickers, which is nice, but I felt like I did not need them. Um, and you can honestly put whatever you want in this, like highlighters, blushes, bronzers, you name it. But this is what it looks like. So it's, it might be a little bit bulky for your average like Z palette person, but I wasn't looking for average. I'm, I'm kind of over the whole just traditional looking Z palette. I wanted something a little fancier and something a little cooler. <laughs> so this is how it opens, which I think is awesome. So it looks like this. It has these little protectors to help protect whatever is inside. Right now I have just my blushes and bronzers and contour colors in here and it comes with an amazing, huge mirror. This whole thing can bend whichever way that you need it to bend, which I think is awesome. Um, that is a huge, huge plus for me, especially because it's bigger and has all of these different compartments to it, but you can bend it whichever way that you want, so I love that about it. Um, and let me kind of hold it a little back for you guys to see the full length of it. Again, this might be excessive to some, it might be too much, but Again, I was looking for something different and something a little bit more fun and neat and had a little bit more character to it. And I love it. And this mirror is just so big and amazing. So um, if you are a traveler too and you need like your essentials in here, you can just pop it in here and then you have your mirror to go. Like I said, this thing bends whichever way that you need it to bend. So it's just amazing. I also find the magnetic piece on here to be really strong. I'm still able to pull things up without having to fight it. I don't like that. I have dropped this a few times before and nothing has broken inside and it seems to hold the magnets really, really well. So no complaints there either. So the next one is also Adept Cosmetics. I never heard of Adept Cosmetics before until I was just searching re like really nice whatever magnetic palettes on YouTube and I heard some people talk about these so I looked them up on Amazon and that's how I found them. Again, I outgrew the marble palette so I was like, you know what, let me see what else that they have and they ended up having something that I needed. So this one is another magnetic pan but this one holds over 100 standard eyeshadow pans um, and this one's a hard case so the other one that i was showing you guys is a little bit more um, cardboardy but this one is plastic so this one comes in a couple colors but of course i got black because i love black so when you open this bad boy up oh, i just love this so much this is what it looks like and it has a clear acrylic casing over it so that neither one of these can touch each other and it just helps to secure them a little bit more. Currently I have 108 eyeshadows in here so that is about the maximum that it will hold for this size eyeshadow. Um, if you have smaller eyeshadows it will definitely hold a lot more. Like the ColourPop ones, if you were to depot like their mini palettes, you can still put these in here too, which would be lovely. But I, I love this so, so much. Yeah, again, it's not your standard Z palette. It might not be as travel friendly. It is a little bit heavier. But again, I was looking for something just to wow me a little bit more. And I just, I, I have no complaints about it. Yeah, it's thick. Yeah, it's a little heavy. But uh, it's really pretty to look at. And I just love the way it holds everything in here. I've also dropped this too, but it wasn't so far from the ground. It was more like my lap to the ground. Again, nothing broke, nothing popped out. So 
and no complaints about this. Okay, so I have two more things I wanna show you guys, so we're almost finished. But this one is the Rolano LED Video Light panel built in 5000 ma lithium battery it has a 3200 to 6500 kelvin which is the light from warm to cool and then um, it's adjustable which is really nice and this was for 32.99 this is what it looks like. So I was in the market for getting an LED light because I wouldn't say I'm like a huge traveler, but I feel like there are some years where I travel a lot more than others. And a lot of the times lighting was never on my side when I'm in a hotel. Now I know what you're probably thinking, like why do you care if the lighting is, you're there to relax, this, that, the other. Yes and no for me. Um, I love doing makeup, it's my job, it's something that I truly enjoy. It gets frustrating sometimes when some hotels are like a dungeon and I can't even see what I'm doing and I wanted to look nice that day or we're going out to eat and I wanted to look put together. So I was in the market for something like this and I'm so, 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 so glad that I picked this up. Let me show you guys really quick. So this is what it looks like. You have the on button, then you have the adjustments for dimming the light for bright to, to darker, and then um, the warm and cool intensity. So if you like a cooler light or a warmer light to it, this is also chargeable. So you just plug it into the wall and then you're set. So I'm gonna turn this on for you guys really quick. I'm gonna face it the other way. You hold it, you see how bright this is? Now I think I have it on warm. Yeah, now I'm gonna switch it to cool and you can see my skin changing. Um, let me show you guys really quick. It's gonna get really dim in here now. <laughs> but this is what it looks like on me. You can see my face a lot brighter. And then quickly I wanna show you guys like the dimming aspect of it. So really, really nice, nice light. So yeah, I like this for multiple different reasons. One for traveling, especially for traveling. So I have that light for me. It is so incredibly lightweight. I feel like this is not even a pound. It's so crazy as I'm whipping this around. Just super, super travel friendly. You could put this in your purse and not even know that it's in there. This can also be a light if you like to film videos and you need something a little bit brighter when you're filming. This is a great option. Another one is our power went out this thing lit an entire room so i thought that was pretty neat so this little light gives off a great amount of power and light to it if you are a makeup artist and you're working with clients and maybe you're not in the best lighting this is great this is a great great option um, or even just like taking makeup pictures too for yourself or for your clients you have the light on and you can sit and capture the shot so so many options that you can have with this it's just so handy to me and it's one of my favorite purchases so the last product that i'm going to show you is actually what i would use to attach this to have a little stand it's currently being used by my mic right now so i'm going to switch to my iphone so i can show you guys what it looks like this is from a company called manfrotto i believe that's how you pronounce it it is just their pixie mini tripod in black and i got this for 27.99 as you can see it's holding my mic right here. You can just detach this, attach it to your camera, which is what I'm filming on right now. You can attach this to your iPhone. You can attach this to anything that you need to hold. Again, you can also attach it to this light to help to hold it up. So this thing literally does 101 things for me when it comes to me filming or just doing anything where I need a stand it's amazing like I was saying if you just have maybe your phone to work with for taking videos or taking pictures I have this attachment um, I forgot where I got this from I think where did I get this attachment I can't even remember but I bought this iPhone attachment and this will hook up to that so it does so many things for me and especially like the camera that I'm filming on right now if I'm doing more vlog style things I will pop that right in there and I'll close it so that it's kind of like a stick and it helps to stabilize the camera so you're not just holding the camera and it's all shaky it'll help to stabilize and you could talk and film whatever that you're filming so again if you're somebody who needs you know, an attachment that kind of does everything, it'd be great for you. But if you're not someone like us who's doing like videos and pictures or lighting, things like that, you probably won't need it, but it is a lifesaver. Brianna Fox actually recommended it to me because she has it. 
And she's right, like it is the best. But yeah, that concludes all of my favorite Amazon purchases thus far within my own little beauty edition. I try my hardest not to just buy anything and necessarily buy junk because there's a lot of things that you can get on Amazon. But all of these things are gold mine. Like, Every single one of these things are heavily used in my day-to-day -day activity. So yeah, just let me know what you guys think. Put it in the comment section below. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe to all my videos if you guys like to see more. And follow me on Instagram. My name is Amanda Devon on there. We're a little bit more interactive. And that's all I got for you guys today. So until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.